Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm not going to share anything related to animation, specifically about the questions regarding animation. So this is the video I'm creating for telling my story behind what I'm doing. So when I started learning animation, I was not knowing anything about animation. Because I wasted one year of my college, I just dropped off from engineering. And I was thinking that I wasted my one year. So what should I do next? And I was very fortunate that I met one of my school friend and he told me that he is doing animation. So he took me to the institute where he was studying. And I went with him. And I didn't know anything about animation. I just went there and I had a visit around. So just at looking the infrastructure, I got a gut feeling that I want to do animation. I never ever thought about doing animation earlier. I didn't even know what animation is. But just by looking around, I decided to go into animation because anyways, I was wasting one year. So I didn't want to waste any more time. So that was the most important reason me joining animation because that was the thing that came in front of me at that point of time. Maybe universe wanted me to do this. But then I stepped into animation. I learned animation in three years. Then I worked as an animator for six to seven years. And in this whole scenario, the whole experience, what I've got, the work experience, as well as the learning experience, what I understood is there is a lot of problem in the marketplace. Like students like me don't even know what animation is and they are just stepping it into it. And maybe I was fortunate that I liked it and I pursued my career in it. I worked as an animator. Maybe most of the students don't even know where they want to go. They are just entering the field because somebody has told them or they have seen some success stories or anything, but they are not connecting that thing to themselves. So then with the experience what I've got and the problem which I found out that there is no clarity in the students what they want to do in life. And if they are meant for doing creative things, like if they are creative, then they should go for animation. But then they don't know anything about it. What are the different streams? What is the pipeline? And what are the different departments, the designations in animation? So they might be thinking that, okay, 3D animation, I'll create cartoons. But what's there inside it? There are a lot of things inside it. It's not just cartoons, like creating cartoons. There are a lot of departments into it, which they don't have a knowledge. And that is not taught also. So I have faced this problem and I made up my mind that now I have the knowledge, I have the work experience. So I should help others find out their passion. Like if they are creative and they are thinking of getting into animation, I should clarify it so that they can see a clear picture of themselves in the future. If they don't know anything about that, I tell them, I inform them, I provide my knowledge, I share my knowledge with them that this is the thing, this is how it is done. These are the departments, this is the pipeline. Now, what are you more interested in? This thing, this thing or that thing? 
so accordingly i can help them to find out what exactly they like they might be curious about the cartoons but what exactly what exactly they like about it the movements or the creatures or anything because the artists who are there in the industry know everything about it because they have worked and gained experience but as a layman as a beginner you might not be knowing anything nowadays internet is there but then if you don't know something and if you are not uh, informative like if you are not a resourceful person then you will not be able to find it because resourceful people can find anything they want they can't just stop searching and they find it whatever they want to find but the people the students who are not resourceful they just want everything to get served into the platter but then we are there we are there to serve you i am there to coach you so because of the problem what i have faced i connected it got connected and i thought that there are a lot of students who might be facing the same problem which i had so i should help them i should help them in any way possible so here i am this is the only reason i am doing this because i want all the students to have a proper knowledge about the stream which they want to do or which they are moving into in because you are going to spend a lot of time with that a lot of money you are going to invest a lot of mind you are going to invest so if you don't have any idea about that thing how will you put your 100% into it so if you know everything then you can put your 100% like what happens is we start learning and we spend around 3 to 4 years in it and we have fun a lot of fun but then when we get into the work environment we realize that we are nowhere i specifically i was so so uh, uh, what i say worried and so under confident like outside i was confident i i think that i thought that i would be able to clear the interview but what happened is when they gave me a test i was literally shivering that what should i do i was not knowing how do i start doing animation because i didn't have the knowledge which the studio is requiring so for applying a job you should have a specific kind of a knowledge which you might not be having i was not having so i realized this problem and i want to solve this problem for all the students out there who want to get into 3d animation as your career so this was it this was the reason why i am here to serve the people and you can ask me anything related to the 3d animation career you can drop me an email or you can comment on my videos you can reach out to me via youtube my social media accounts i would be really happy to serve you if i share my information if i share my knowledge with you that's the most happiness i get because some day you are going to give me blessings that this was the guy who helped me so 
that is the thing i love i love helping people so i have decided that i will help the students find clarity in 3d animation find clarity in their career what they want to choose and if they want to choose animation then i am here to help them so thank you guys for watching this and listening to my story till the end and i hope that you will be taking action and you will find out your purpose and you will have a knowledge about what you are doing or where you are moving before getting into it that is my only motto thank you so much and see you soon in my next video